Okay, hello everybody, welcome to day three of the ladder. 22 games in the first two days. <laughs> and here we are, day two, he's 300 TV down nearly. <laughs> he's probably like, what is going on? Sigini Nikki? Sigi Nikki? I don't know, whatever that is. Um, he's 4-1-0. He's got some dodge, a wrestle, another wrestle and an edge three, an armor nine. And a kick, 12 players. Interesting build, isn't it? Three Blitzers, two Witch Elves. Strange build, but he's been successful with it. 4-1-0. And uh, I got the third reroll. So that's... I really like having the third reroll, but... Really wanted to get matched versus anybody. So there you go. Oh, dear. Rookie error spinning while Jimmy is too, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny back. Oh dear. Wizard and Apple. Elves with the wizard can always win, can't they? So. Pro elfing. Oh, you can be a pro elf like the others. <laughs> Cyber Knight's going to be very strong this season as he's using a real team instead of Brett's. And while we may meme about how crap uh, Pro Elves are, they're still better than Bretts, aren't they? <laughs> they're still Elves, and therefore shit on Bretts, <laughs> in terms of being a good team. Bretts would have a decent shot at beating them in a match, but um, Pro Elves, uh, Bretts are a terrible team, I think. Hey Jimmy, have a nice game. Hello. He's kicking. See, I prefer, I really do prefer kicking because when they've got a wizard, because then you can know what's going on. <laughs> she killed Roxy, oh man. <laughs> wow, brutal. <laughs> oh, dear me. 62%. Pretty good. Yeah, maybe his music is a cheeky ziggy. SRL. Hello, Crystal Hunter. Thanks for the recaps, by the way. I tried to watch it, but I haven't had much time. <laughs> Why not shit elves? <laughs> oh, the game time. Oh, he's at 62. 62. All right, that's, that's all right. 62 minutes is fine, isn't it? 62 minutes is pretty good. Oh, yeah, not that he's not Sigini because of the game time. No, yeah, but it's a good good opponent because of the game time. I thought you were saying not good coach because of the game time, but that's actually perfect, isn't it? Perfect game time. Right, so let's go. Um, claw against the armor nine makes sense, doesn't it? What's with mighty blow? Tip for Bernie Buffon. <laughs> he is the setup against uh, <laughs> against uh, Blit getting Blitz done if someone does an offset LOS. Have I ever fouled a DP? Not a lot, to be honest. I haven't fouled him much. Nice. A deep kick. Interesting. No, he just gave up because he's physically unable to play too many times. Boo! I knew that was going to be bought down against the fucking wrestle. Fuck's sake. 
Get someone else to go on Samba for him. <laughs> oh dear. Well, unspectacular first turn, wasn't it? But it'll, see, I hit him with the claw because he was the worst one, isn't he? Claw's the worst one, so that was the idea. Maybe took the AV because he was expecting to run into Pro Elves. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fluffy burrito. Fumble does host Naftonis like tabletop style. Yes, Night and Blood Bowl. And Blood Bowl 2 will be able to soon. Um, so there you go. <laughs> soon to um, no really soon I mean I've, I've got to fucking smash the ladder haven't I I'm smashing the ladder because that's what I was going to do and uh yes res yeah. just exactly the same as nafton Packs. Yeah, exactly the same as now games. <laughs> All right. So we can we can we can cage fully here. Not a problem. I'm gonna put the guard in there so I can punch him. And another guard in there, yes. So he wants to go here for the blitz. And blitz him because he's behind enemy lines. Oh, a double a quad skulls here is pretty bad, isn't it? Oh, that, all, that all failed now. Maybe I still could punch there. Oh, got the power, could have hit the blodger. Pretty shitty. You should really advertise the naked Artemis Prize. No, no, no. It is soon. I've got. I've got to focus on playing, smashing all these games out, and then, and then I'll take a while working things out 
with uh, the NAF people and everything and, and working out how, how it's all going to work. Hello, McCavity. Yeah, I hate wrestle as well. <laughs> yeah. Indeed, exactly that's what I was thinking, Nightwind, yeah. Because it was horrible, because it was... It was horrible because there was kind of like no point playing it because you could be playing Chance Ladder instead. Whereas now, yeah, this was dangerous, wasn't it, pushing him to here because now he's got the double push and the serve. The good thing is if he goes for this and gets it, then at least it's a big commitment in players. And it does mean that I should be able to score apart from the wizard. Strength, blodge, hobgum with shooter hands. Fucking hell. Leader is alright, I think. For like the team. Because he's got everything he needs. Once he's got strength, blodge, shooter hands, he's got everything he needs. I had a strength four, blodge, hobgoblin with shooter hands. And I went kick a return and kick. <laughs> so, um, I think what's probably a good bet is, yeah, he's going for it. That's probably a good bet. It's something like uh, kick, uh, something like leader. Oh, go goody powered me. <laughs> goody one dice powered me. Okay, now. Yeah, sidestep's pretty good. But leader could be okay. Um, but yeah, sidestep's pretty good, isn't it? Oh, fuck. Big commitment though, isn't it? The stun is means that I can't really reverse very well. I don't I'd rather go sidestep. Actually, can't really capitalise, can I? Even though you put all those players over there, I can't even capitalise. Because if I if I split my team, that just plays into his hands, doesn't it? I'll go for the guy. Who's behind enemy lines? Do nothing. Phew. Rough. Yeah, I guess guard's fine, yeah. Yeah, sidestep is pretty fucking good. Oh, that was a bit weak versus a fucking wizard there without that GFI. It was a bit unnecessary, but... Could take break tackle, yeah, for two plus dodges. Yeah, it's not a bad idea, is it? It's like, because you'd take sure heads on him. You'd take sure heads. <laughs> you'd take two heads on him if he was a beast man, probably, wouldn't you? So, yeah, break tackle wouldn't be bad at all. Oh, God, I'm fucking knackered. <laughs> Two heads is a lot better than break tackle, but do you know what I mean? It's not like just stupid or anything. Sure, heads are two. Everyone's got two hands, haven't they?
<laughs> oh, it's not insensitive. No, I'm definitely the wrong person for rolling good as well. Though I love my chaos of rolled good level ups in, in Rebel. And I've had mostly good dice this season. Charm him in. And hit with mighty blow. Ugh, it's frustrating when you don't kill everything, isn't it? Good bow. Like to, br I'd like to buy an armor break, please. Could I do that? Have I broken armor yet this game? I don't think so. On turn fucking four, four turns of not breaking armor ever. It was a little disappointing. You can definitely um, you can definitely roll better in real life, can't you? I would I would suggest if you play tabletop, learn how to roll dice better. Absolutely, something you can absolutely do for tabletop. Online, it's not so easy. Claw the witch, yeah. Oh, God. And the threat of the wizard as well. This is why I like the kick, because generally, if you've kicked, you've probably removed a player or two by the time it gets to their drive. Burp, burp. And burp, then it's burp, easier burp. to score when they're down players, isn't fail. it? I'm on the right. burp, burp, burp. When they've got a full 11 players and a wizard, you're left having to try and get lucky and remove a player or two to make it a bit easier. Oh, I'm surprised you didn't get an extra block there. He could have got an extra block, couldn't he? Yeah, he is, he is, he is herp derp base base basing, but it's quite good when you never get your armor broken. Pretty good strat when you never get your armor broken, is basing. Yeah, I am a casino dice player, 100%, I love it. Oh man, he does the dirty one dice. One dice, pal. AV break as well. So far, two AV breaks for the fucking... Fucking Dark Elves. No fucking AV breaks for the fucking Chorfs. Oh, double skulls, yeah, mate, yeah, why not?
fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> How could it be anything else? How could it have been anything fucking else? Jesus Christ. What a fucking game this has been. Knockdowns was the problem there, wasn't it? Not fucking uh, things. I probably shouldn't have made that block. Probably shouldn't have made that block. Oh, another armor break. Oh, a Kaz. All oh, good. I mean, okay, he's armor seven, but still. Just get a cheeky fucking Kaz, why don't you? Because I did that one dice block that was a fucking skull, that if it had been a push even, it would have been great. Oh, This is so fucked. Even that's pretty good for him, isn't it? It's his wrestle guy. It's his one wrestle guy gets the both down. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Ties with a bucket. <laughs> every every block's a knockdown for him. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Doesn't one dice pal? Unfucking believable. News of the year, that I think. <laughs> Doesn't one dice pal? <laughs> right. Jesus, titty fucking Christ. I think I'll have to block here. Yeah. Where are you gonna knock down? Outrageous. Didn't expect an armor break. Didn't expect a knockdown. <laughs> Cast there, <laughs> randomly, randomly hit a blodger with a one guy without a tackle. Power apple. Fuck's sake. Right, two GFIs at least to score. Fucking hell. Which guys are the chops? Yeah. <laughs> Looking crazy, isn't it? So now at least we're both on 10 men, but things are going very badly still. Got to get this out nil nil, haven't I, pretty much? I mean, I do deserve it, of course, you know, of course. I, I mean, it's not like. <laughs> it's not like I haven't diced people and I haven't been up TV every every single match this season, but still, it's still frustrating, isn't it, in an individual match? Maybe the rest of the team is shin and doing something, hopefully.
Yeah, which is good, but he's appoed it. He's power appoed. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Fluffy Burrito. Yeah, yeah, it's horrible, isn't it? It's horrible. Yeah, indeed a dump, yeah. Indeed. Having to play a real game, very disappointing. No, but it's not, it's not bad, is it? It is pretty tricky. Very tricky. He's got the wizard. He won the toss. He's one diced. <laughs> I don't know how I get forward and protect it, that's the thing, isn't it? Because he's got the wizard. So. Dirty D not. A one dice is set up a two dice and gets away with it. He can't keep getting away with it! Another AV break? Yes, why not? Right. I like how the claw has hit the AV9 every single turn. <laughs> Finally gets an AV break. Turn 7. No, oh, Kaz! Another one. I guess I should have blitzed with the uh, dodge guy. I don't know. Let's crucify it. I guess I shouldn't have crucified it. I guess I should have done. <laughs> I guess I should have done it one at a time. Because I could have stopped there and that would have been good enough, wouldn't it? I did I did I did need him there. I didn't need him here, I guess. I guess I shouldn't have full crucified it. That was a bit dumb. Only one in range. Yeah, it was a bit dumb doing full crucifer. I mean, the reason why full crucifer is a thing is because it's a fucking stupid thing to do, isn't it? So I shouldn't have done it because it was fucking stupid. So this was a lot better here, but I, you know, once I'd used the sure hands, I should have sure feet, I should have sure hands. I keep saying sure hands. Oh, there's a chance. There's a chance. Not much. <laughs> Not much, but there was a chance. Oh, 
Hey! That was his Edge 3 guy, wasn't it? Alright. GFI, because then I get this murder him. Which is good, isn't it? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, so one, two, three, GFI, GFI, pass. He's got two scoring threats. One, two, three, four, five. That's right, isn't it? Four, five, six, GFI, GFI. So if I go there, that's in a pretty good spot. Oh, fuck off, man. <laughs> Right, without a reroll, it's probably it's got to be better to do the uh, double GFIs. Good afternoon, Marzum. No, no, he's 1300 odd. He's got quite a good team. Ooh, double one. He's got a good team and a wizard. And he's a good coach. And he's had pretty good dice. <laughs> Which has helped his cause. But I, I shouldn't have stacked the GFIs. Played shit. Played shit, got punished. And that's the whole fucking point of... Of saying why Christopher's fucking stacking the GFIs is shit. is because it's shit. And then I would just fucking... Because I'm memeing. I fucked myself over, didn't I? Memeing, which was pretty stupid. It was pretty stupid. Memeing and fucking myself because of it. It was pretty dumb. No more meaning with this team. Now it's just serious business trying to win. Yeah, at least he didn't, he didn't score. So yeah, a tie should be doable and maybe a win. <laughs> yeah, no more fucking meaning. <laughs> there is no money on the line. It's the most important thing ever. Maybe I can name a bit. Seeing as it doesn't matter at all. <laughs> a blitz and a bull catch would be amazing, wouldn't it? But instead it looks like a witch catch. Could have put guard and bulls on the LOS to try and deny the LOS, but I thought 
if I do that, he might just fucking try and score quickly, and I want to try and turn him over and win one nil. So I didn't want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly, Puzzle Hunter, yeah. Sad times, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know, sure, that's a good point, isn't it? That's a good point. I'm just going to hurt Derp here. No questions asked. Absolute Herb derp thon Did take plus AV, yeah. Oh, gotta move this guy first. Guy furthest forward seems sensible, doesn't it? Right. Didn't go full herb derp from there. Next turn, next turn, full herb derp. Yeah, killing the guy furthest forward is obviously the best strat, but at least punch him. This is quite good, three guard is in contact, isn't it? The red thing above the line elf's head. Very good. It is plus AV. <laughs> There's a good coach who's in OFL as well, and he used to take plus AV on, on line elves. I have clawed him every single turn, Marzen. I have blocked him eight times with claw. <laughs> And broken AV once. <laughs> so not it, and seven times I've hit him with claw. And broken AV once. <laughs> Plus AV is supposed to be. It looks like a ball, doesn't it? I don't know what it's meant to be. <sighs> Fuck off, man. Stop breaking my AV more than you. I break yours. But well, he's got 13, maybe he's a shoulder pad? Maybe he's going to be a pauldron. Glorious! <laughs> got a sub for the meme GFIs. <laughs> Thanks, movie burrito. <laughs> yeah, the meme GFIs worked out brilliantly. <laughs> Very good, McCavity. Um... Thank you very much for staying fantastic, Fluffy Burrito. Glorious. Uh.
Right, so now we can go somewhat omens. Pauldron. There's nothing more Games Workshop than pauldrons, is there? Right. Oh, no, I had to geofight the Blitz. Oh, balls. <laughs> No, because I didn't push him, I don't get that block. Oh, that was a fuck up. Surf there, can you? Go for a one in, don't re-roll it. Oh yeah. Bit of a fuck up there with that. I should have blitzed should have blitzed with the claw. There. Price hikes. <laughs> World of Warcraft have taken it to the next level, but that was copied off Games Workshop, wasn't it? So. Yeah, that's what I've been doing, yeah. I've hammered him with claw continuously. <laughs> continuously hammered with claw to no avail. <laughs> Two into a one, gets a pow, classic. And an AV break too, no, Un unbelievable. Can't believe he frenzy trapped himself. Well, I can, who wouldn't frenzy trap themselves, let's be honest. He's in scoring range, so I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to stop, I'm gonna have to defend, because I've got to win one nil, haven't I? I've got to. No, sure, Skirro, but there's a difference between derivatives and completely ripped off from another company doing exactly the same thing. <laughs> Isn't it? I mean, come on. Come on, man. This frees up the player, so I want to do it. It doesn't actually free up the player now. Well, it does, I guess. Technically, it does. Kaz. Oh, boo. Deserve to die for the power apple. <laughs> oh, I know. Oh, he's got two apples. That's why he power apple. He's got two apples. Oh, man, he's really planning on scoring.
Well, what's his option here? Scoring doesn't seem very good. Unless he uphills for a push and then one D's there. So maybe I should watch these guys a little bit. And stay... Stay central. Maybe haven't done enough to stop him scoring. I don't know. Let's do this. Leave that. A witch elf got Kaz twice for Fubrito. Kaz the witch, yeah, he's just gonna go back. Kaz witch elves twice. Um, he's up on both of them. Maybe I should have left him like more midfield. I don't know. Maybe I should have left him there. A new pitch. I didn't know that, no. He's rolling one! Oof. He's rolled a one! Ooh! Is he in range of the ball? Yes, he is. <laughs> Johnny Five. Oh, he didn't roll a one. Boo. Yeah. Roll a one, you fuck. <laughs> They're annoying when they don't roll one and roll all knockdowns and armor breaks, aren't they, elves? Fuck's sake, man. Just stop breaking armor with every block. Will ya? <laughs> right. I need stuff in the middle of the pitch, don't I? I don't want to have too much stuck on one side here. Safe moves first, by the way. Push, 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 no AV breaks. Push, push, no AV breaks. Pow, 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 stun, stun, stun. Pow, pow, pow. <laughs> Fucking hell. It's rough. Rough match, this, isn't it? Very rough. But they were absolutely rock hard today. And so was my cock. <laughs> that was my cat. Three re rolls. For four turns. Maybe I should start pushing my luck. Breeding some rolls, maybe.
<laughs> because of Armadil. Well, first of all, it's nil-nil, but second of all, I actually have Kaz two Witch Elves. But, um, he's appled both Witch Elves, and he's just been powering me every block. And I've been not powering him, and he's been breaking AV every turn, and I've been not breaking AV on him. So, that makes it pretty tricky. <laughs> oh, he's failed something now, though. He has failed something now. Interesting. Interesting. Thing is, these fucking dwarves can't get over, can they? So I can go for the seventy-five percent hit on the uh, on the witch, can't I? Which is all right, especially if other things are taken care of. Or I could blitz him and base the witch, but basing the witch doesn't really do much. I'd like to have the strength 4 here, but then if I put the strength 3 out there, you can get surfed, which isn't great. It's a lot harder to surf the strength 4 if the strength 4 is over there. Don't need a recovery, I'll just catch it. Don't know if you've seen this game this team played before, Lil Baz, but uh, my bulls just catch the balls. They don't <laughs> they don't <laughs> every time my bulls just catch the balls. <laughs> every time. <laughs> catch like a mongoose though. <laughs> Every fucking time these these bulls just catch it. Mental. Jump up is a thing, yeah. Yeah, it didn't break AV. Of course not. No AV breaks again that turn. Knock down half his team, no AV breaks. No, oh, I've got block and you don't. Ah, oh, shit. Powers me, Blodger. What a joke. So unlucky. Worst possible matchup, yeah. The bulls are on the loose now, though, aren't they? So. The game's stretched. The values of the bull go. The values, the value of the bulls goes up once the game is stretched like this. So I almost said a sentence there. Oh, fuck down, shit. Yeah, I probably had a team called that, yeah. Ah. 
Yeah, exactly. The fact he did the blitz, he can't hand off or anything. as well. Oh. Ho, 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 So I think I just want to blitz with the uh, with the ball carrier, don't I? Seems like a good thing to do. Oh shit! There's a oh no! I can I can knock him over. I can knock him over. It's all right. Don't panic. Contained. Right, so we've got a bull that can get all the way over there. That's pretty good, isn't it? I can't. I can't risk GFIs. With a hob. <laughs> and, and I'm not I'm, I'm not gonna crucify for that. <laughs> right. Anything can happen. Both bulls on the hob in range. Even this hob's in range, isn't he? If he has to be. Crucifering is taking all the GFIs together, yeah, which maybe cost me the game here. It's a good point, Wormthrax, yeah. Oh, he's failed. He has failed. One in nine happens. Um, I'm going to three dice this. Just to make sure. One, two, three, four, GFI. He can't hit, can't he, with him? And what about her? Hmm. It's not actually, uh, it's not actually safe. <laughs> Stupidly, I can't, I can't just get him safe. I thought I could just get him safe, but it's not. I might have to GFI. Might actually have to GFI. If we go there, you can hit. If we go there, you can only base. She can only base as well. So, a GFI puts us pretty much safe. Phew. Phew. Oh, I do 
didn't need to do that, did I? I can two D him first. You can only pace anyway. Can dodge double geophyte a base. He can three plus two plus double geophyte a base. This stops that one, pretty much, but doesn't affect that one. I guess that's probably best. It's not done yet, Destro. There's a chance of a blitz and a base and dice failing. It's still not done. It's not over yet. That three dice I probably shouldn't have done. Then I could have had the bull over there. Phew. I can't do a chorf TD. <laughs> I can't. I can't. I can't risk a hand off on this turn, can I? Phew. Three, four, five, six, seven, three, four, five, three, four, five, six, seven, that's right, isn't it? Three, four, five, six, seven. I can't do it though. I want. I want to hit him on three dice, don't I? Whoa! That fucked right up. Okay, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna hit him on three dice without block. I'll hit him on two dice with block. Phew! Me too. Not in the end, but thanks. Yeah, he ran out of time, didn't he, that turn? Phew! <laughs> I do need SPP, but I'm not going to do it when it's nil-nil. <laughs> I'm not going to do it in nil-nil, but yeah, I'll, you know, I would have... Um, I would have got... If I was 1-0 up, I would have gone for it, because winning 2-0 wouldn't have mattered. It was, wasn't it? It was, yeah. Maybe he's actually just got out of the game. <laughs> I think it was, yeah. <laughs> oh, dear. Hello, Ori Lenses. Oh, dear. Yeah, eight. Eight, eight block skulls, yeah. Because it was a triple, then another triple, and then, uh, and then a double. Jim is the shit that gets away with everything. I didn't. I didn't get away with a triple stack uh, GFI or lenses. It was stupid, and I'm. I'm not going to do it any again. I was old Crucifer this, and then it fell, and I was like, oh, that's why. That's why it's a Crucifer thing. <laughs> it's not actually a good thing. I think 11, 11 concedes. Chorf MVP is obviously amazing. One with the cars as well. Yeah, very nice. Very nice. Good old blue head. Yeah, I guess the chance of a misclick on the on the extra blocks was was worth not doing them for. To be fair. Right, another guarder is good. And need to get the hobgoblin. I probably shouldn't have rerolled that because I had enough for an extra hob, and I shouldn't have uh, shouldn't have taken any chances, should I? Right, so we've got a hob. 12 men's for the next match. A nice trim 1640. Um, it was against Inarin, I think, uh, Adont. Inarin's woodies were getting beaten up by Orcs. I think it was the season that Inarin won, or one of the seasons where Inarin won the whole thing as well. Um. <laughs> Epiphany. <laughs> right, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.